Well, my, my life changed four years ago when I had my little boy um, and I realised I knew nothing and I didn't know how to do anything anymore. And up until that point, you know, work was always my number one absolute priority. And at first, I, I was a little bit worried, you know, am I going to be able to be the same person at work? Uh, it's, it probably sounds ridiculous, but I think, you know, a lot of women can probably relate to that when you have a baby, you feel like you lose yourself a little bit. And I've just been supported non-stop. All the way through my line management, they've got kids as well, they understand, they allow me to do what I need to do and still enjoy my job and still give what I need to give. I went to the University of Newcastle and we did um, environmental science and that was when I really started to become interested in what, what do industries do in terms of impact on the environment and how can they help the environment. And then after that, project management became its own thing and I realised I, I like the idea of delivering something with a beginning and an end rather than doing an ongoing job day to day. I like the idea of achieving something. So I went back to university, I went to the University of Sunderland and I did a Masters in Engineering and Construction Project Management. And then immediately after that, I applied for the graduate scheme here. I had a stint um, as a sewer maintenance operative. I did a stint in the compliance team, which was looking at sort of environmental compliance on the network. We did a, a, a few studies and some of the information I, I had fed into um, a European court case that was going on. So that was really interesting. I actually now looking back, realised they gave us quite high profile pieces of work to do, considering I was just a graduate. Then I came back to asset delivery and just got given projects, chucked right in at the deep end and uh, never really looked back. Usually in my line of work it will be water treatment works and um, so there will be various stakeholders internal and external within the business. A lot of the work I do is driven by water quality standards. It might be that something brand new is now to be regulated and you have to install a brand new kit or it might just be substantial upgrading of existing kit. So overall it's to make sure that what comes out the other end of the treatment works meets the standard that it needs to to get to the tap. Every project's different, every group of people that you work with is different. There's always a challenge, something's always changing, no day is the same, but we're a very collaborative group of people in our department and I really like pulling together with the supply chain.